So you want to look out for the little guy, you want to do your part, make the world a better place, all that, right? Yeah, 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 just looking out for the little guy. That's what it is. Hey, you're watching Wobble Boy on YouTube. Hey, how's it going YouTube? It's your boy Wobble Boy here. And this video is gonna be a little different. First of all, hope you guys are doing well due to everything that's going on with COVID-19. Hope everyone is safe and using social distancing skills and or staying at home. Bravo if you still are. Now, like I said, this video is gonna be a little different. Um, as we all know, big events are happening in the gaming world. Um, for one, normal Xbox dropped their, you know, systems. And the biggest one was PlayStation, or biggest for me personally. PlayStation dropped theirs, and as you can tell, for those that did and those that didn't, they couldn't have enough units for people to pre-order. I mean, we're talking Walmart, GameStop, Best Buy, Target, Sam's Club, you name it. They've all been sold out worldwide. I myself haven't been able to access that with any luck but lo and behold i'm scrolling through twitter and i see a fellow content creator um has purchased quite a few playstation 5s and supposedly are giving them away in a giveaway and if you don't know who i'm talking about i'm talking about your boy afro send you um i've subscribed to him for quite a while and you know he's a pretty cool guy you know pretty cool makes decent content but when he sent out a tweet I'll show you guys actually right here uh, first tweet was you know he bought 16 or, or I think I believe it was a little bit more than that PS4 could be wrong I gotta reread it and then he posted another tweet says who wants a PS5 now obviously I mean I could be like one of the thousands if not hundreds of thousands of people that comments on that I commented on that at first and this is my first initial tweet Pretty, you know, self-explanatory, you know, I mean, yeah, I'd, I'd asked for one. And I had a little funny gift, you know, uh, uh, talking about it. But I got to thinking. I'm like, you know what? If I really would like to, I guess, up my chances at uh, this quote-unquote giveaway, I'm going to take it a little step further. But also, I started to think about hmm, who would be a better way of approaching this opportunity and I decided to uh, send out this tweet when I thought about it more that one I issued a challenge to Afro Senju that I think he you know would be really beneficial and would be nice to work on an idea like this with him but I issued a challenge to him to basically instead of just giving or I, if I guess win the giveaway when it comes to you know the lottery of when it comes to giving away the PS5 I was like you know what I'll play you for it you know like guy to guy man to man I'll, I'll, I'll instead of I've always been taught um handouts or you know if you, if you take it you take it you know everybody needs a little help every now and then but at the same time nothing beats hard work and trying to obtain certain things for yourself in life and you know as a I guess a fellow content creator slash african-american man I've always been you know, like I said just taught that I earn what I get you know what I mean like see well like the money that he probably earned Afro send you earned to purchase all those ps5s he earned that through hard work and determination you know doing his craft and same thing with me so I pose a challenge to you, Afro Sindri, like instead of just giving me the PS5, I'll challenge you for it, one-on-one, -on -one. in this, Super Smash Brothers. I mean, it's a game that me and you know pretty well, and, you know, best man wins. But here's the thing, if I end up do winning, I won't even keep the PS5 for myself. I would actually give it to my lovely girlfriend, Jay, who... As of now, currently doesn't even own, has never actually owned a system. Side side story, never really owned a system. Yes, we did purchase a Switch together, but again, that's together. So, and it's mainly over at my household too. Uh, we don't currently live together, but you know, we go back and forth. But she's never actually owned her own system together. I mean, her own system by herself. 
And like I said, with everything that's been going on with the PS5 releases, I wasn't able to snag, let alone one for me or her. But Afro sent you, if you accept this challenge, um, hopefully, you know, maybe you see this, maybe you don't, but if you end up doing, like I said, I'd rather just play you uh, man to man, you know, uh, winner take all type of thing. You know, if I win, hey, maybe I can get a PlayStation 5 and give it to my girlfriend. You know, I'll even record that par par part of the project and or take pictures of it you know, just to prove that I really won't keep it for myself I'm not that kind of person like I'm I will just donate it to her right away you know it's a crazy idea <laughs> will work and hopefully maybe you see this Afro Center because at the end of the day at some point in all of our existence we were all the little guy you know just like how in Spider-Man you know in, in uh, Captain America Civil War gotta look out for the little guy you know I mean you know, you've you know grown up you, you've grown to a amazing content creator millions of followers and then you got people like you know me I mean we're steady grinding which is uh, what it's all about hard work and dedication and grinding but sometimes you know instead of just giving it to like one of the other big time you know youtubers looking out for the little guy you know that's all I'm trying to do you know because at some point we were all little guys even you afro you see this I mean you, you know for a fact humble beginnings to rags to riches so like I said end of this video is getting long uh, just a short challenge pretty much Afro send you extend my hand to you hopefully you accept this challenge uh, in Super Smash Brothers pick the time pick the day pick the place we can discuss that in the DMs or whatever so yeah hopefully you guys stay safe and I'll see you in the next one take care and wobble out